had the opportunity back in the early 1990s to uh, try out a new laser for uh, breaking up and treating kidney stones uh, called the Holmium laser. Treated the first uh, humans. Back technology proved uh, eventually to be a very effective form of treatment and is now being used around the world. Years ago we used to do open surgery. We would make a incision in the flank area. Uh, go in, open up the kidney or the ureter and take out the stone. Uh, that was a big invasive operation that involved a week at least in the hospital and six to eight weeks of recovery afterwards. The laser is done is made this a much less invasive operation. It's done routinely as an outpatient, so patients are in and out the same day. It takes an hour or less to do it and the patients generally recover very quickly within a day or two. Uh, Osis in London uh, had one of the uh, early shockwave lithotripters in Canada. Uh, that's another technology for treating kidney stones that's very non-invasive. I've been very fortunate over the years to have lots of opportunity to travel internationally and uh, educate and be involved in training courses for urologists around the world. Uh, those courses typically involve giving lectures but also doing surgery. It provides the chance to uh, advance the technology. Uh, we can uh, spread the word and uh, bring these advances to uh, patients around the world, which is what it's really about.